This one's a little bit tricky because instead of solving for the velocity, you're trying to find what's the mass of one of the objects. So we've got the 1.5 kilogram block sliding along a frictionless surface, moving at 1.2 meters per second, we'll say to the right. A second block, we don't know its size, we don't know its size, but it's traveling at five meters per second. It's going to overtake this block, right? And then they stick to it. So that's before. So afterwards, the two blocks are stuck together. And we know that they're moving now together at 2.4 meters per second, right? So you're going to have to do the, what is the total momentum before. So I'm going to say, I'll call this block 1 and this block 2. I'll say M1 times V1, which is Five plus m2, which is 1.5, times 1.2, equals the total mass times its speed. Now, normally I'd say total mass, but I'm going to say equals to m1 plus m2 times 2.4. But actually, what do we know? We know that the m2 is 1.5. So this is 1.5, and that's our equation. Now we need to now do some math, some algebra, to solve for m1. Frankly, I just use the solver on my calculator to solve it, and you can get what is the mass of block 1. If you need algebra chips, uh, watch another video.